aus Lissabon vom Eurobest Festival auf ein Wort vom Regal on Tour and Sir John Haggerty. Wow. By the way, what is the advantage of being a Sir? It has enormous advantages when I'm booking restaurants. <laughs> Why? <laughs> Because I always get a table. <laughs> <laughs> That's great. On stage you talk about excitement. Why do you love this uh, expression? Well, I, I really talked, the, the whole um, subject matter was creative bravery. How do we get clients to buy braver work? And once you go to that place, you soon get to the word risky. You know, and if you look at um, business books, uh, go to Amazon and look up risk and business books, you find loads and loads of books where people are telling business people they've got to adopt risk, they've got to, you know, risk is the way forward and you can't be, you know. And the problem with that is, I believe, is that it's a word that people don't want to buy. It's, it's do I want a risky job? Do I want a risky day? Do I want a risky car? No. So I say, I understand what people are trying to say, because words are important, the meaning of words are important. So what I try, try and say is, instead of using the word risk, why don't you say, use the word excitement? So when I'm selling a client a piece of work, instead of saying, this is a risky piece of work, but you've got to buy it, they're immediately going, oh, no, 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 no. If I say to them, this is an exciting piece of work, you've got to buy it. Oh, my, okay, I want an exciting life, I want an exciting car, I want an exciting holiday, you know, yeah, I'll go with that. Um, you don't like the expression risk management. It was very funny what you said on stage. So, why? Well, because I think it, it, it's one of those stupid phrases, isn't it, where somebody says, adopt risk and manage it. Well, risk is risk, you know, you can't manage it. Risk is being out of control and you just got to hope it's going to come right. And the idea that you can manage it, it's just stupid, as I said in my talk. It's a bit like those rock bands in, in the uh, late 60s and early 70s who gave themselves silly names like Led Zeppelin or Curved Air or, you know, Soft Machine. I mean, they knew they were stupid. They just thought they were funny. Uh, but people take these things as being serious. So, you know, I was laughing at it. I said, you know, maybe a band called Risk Management might be a good idea. Did you say it's the most exciting time to be in our industry? What? I think... Um, This is undoubtedly a golden age. I really do. I mean, a lot of people say, you know, the golden age of advertising was like Mad Men and we've all seen that. Or, you know, in the UK they talk about the 70s and 80s. I think this is the most exciting time to be in our industry. Why? Because of the way I can now communicate, the platforms upon which I can communicate, the fact that now creativity is fundamentally important to the future. You know, when I came into the, uh, the industry, You know, creativity was not seen as, as important. It was a sort of peripheral where now people realize that creativity is fundamentally important to the future of our industry. And the means by which you can communicate your creativity are much broader. So why is it an exciting time? It must be, surely. Could you give me a, a very soft slap in my face? Because this would be the story told and told and told again right. in Germany. That wasn't very good, was it? I could do a better slap. No, no. <laughs>